It's a public smear over beer. Sam Adams is the latest brand with a Trump problem. At least that's what this Boston Globe headline says. It all started when a Massachusetts mayor, aren't they all, announced on Twitter, how brave, that he'll never drink Sam Adams beer again because the company's co-founder praised Trump's tax cuts. That's all the Sam Adams guy did. He didn't commit a crime. Nobody got hurt. He just had an opinion. In fact, the only thing getting murdered here is the punctuation in this tweet. But, every, but because everyone loves a boycott, others are joining in. And now, we can't like something or anything fun like a beer because the co-founder likes Trump. But when we've boycotted everything, there won't be anything fun left. We're going to need a drug for that. Many white people who do yoga, and it's mostly white people who do yoga. So a uh, few of them understand the culture, the history, and the religion behind yoga. Tired of people telling you why all your hobbies and interests are problematic? It's that new phrase used by social justice warriors who want to sound educated, but don't want to do any thinking to figure out what the real problem is, or if there even is one in the first place. Which means in 2018, your favorite dating shows are sexist, your Halloween costume is cultural appropriation, and your favorite sports bar canceled the NFL package because of all the protests. This is ridiculous. Everything that was once fun is now bad. How am I supposed to have fun again? That's easy. Start taking FRS, Fun Replacement Supplements. They make any activity instantly awesome. It doesn't matter if you're watching The Bachelor, eating tons of red meat, or driving a giant ass car. You won't feel guilty anymore because FRS works directly on the brain to produce euphoria, supreme confidence, and increased energy. Sounds awesome. Is there a secret ingredient? Heck yeah. The secret ingredient in Fun Replacement Supplements is crack. What? In fact, there are no other ingredients. Fun Replacement Supplements is just crack cocaine all by itself. Uh, I don't know. I just took some Fun Replacement Supplements right now. Hey man, what are you doing later? Do you work out? You wanna come over? We can take some more together. Or we can do whatever you want. I'm down. I gotta go. Hey wait man, hold up. Uh, can I borrow 10 bucks? Come on man, you know I'm good for it. I'll pay you back, I swear. Whatever, I never liked you anyway. So get FRS today. Warning, Fun Replacement Supplements are crack, so you should probably steer clear unless you wanna ruin your life. We're not advocating uh, drug use. That's actually the opposite, Tom. But what we're saying here, the message here, so I don't get lectured on Monday by the powers that be, what do you have left when everything fun becomes problematic? All you're going to do is sit in a room and do drugs. That's right. This is the ultimate. This is the ultimate. Just say no, Greg. Yes, it is. Yeah. It is. Or just say yes. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, <laughs> plus, crack, I'm not a crack man. I'm a powder guy. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> no, that's. Uh, <laughs> that, no, I'm anti-drug, as you know, Greg, and yes. uh, never love the crack. Yeah. Good. 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 No. I'm glad we covered that. Ty Tyrus, what do you make of these boycotts? The I always feel like these are fake boycotts, like. People don't really use the product. It's like, I'm never using your waterproof surgical gloves again, you says know, a guy sitting on his couch who doesn't yeah. have a job. You know, <laughs> I used to get mad when I would hear old people when I was a kid talking about, when my day, we had real stuff. Now I'm that guy. In my day, we had real, wait, we didn't really protest much in the 80s and 90s when we were cool. In my grandparents, they had real protests over real issues. Yeah. We protest everything, which means we protest nothing. Mm. So there's... Every time I hear there's a protest, I change the channel because I'm assuming it's over. Word has it, Pop Tart changed their flavor. Yeah. Hashtag hell no. Like, you know, uh, there was a big uproar over Lucky Charms and Frosted Flakes got together and had a bastard child. Yes. That everyone was like, it's too much sugar. It's it's just a box of cereal. Yes. But it's change, and no one likes change. The fact that these protests now, are, and I guess you need like seven or eight people for an actual protest i think so and then one person who has wi-fi to get on twitter <laughs> so that's pretty much what a protest is today but it doesn't really it doesn't really matter whether i'll probably get protested for saying this yeah but luckily i got that gofundme thing started <laughs> so i'm good yes. but holly could this end up back? Could these boycotts end up back backfiring? Like people will just start drinking Sam Adams just to get back at the mayor? Absolutely. D beer. I'm Australian, also American. <laughs> beer is personal, right? Yes. We all have a beer. We grow up with a particular beer. Because some mayor says, "Don't drink a beer." Are you really not going to drink that beer, Greg? No. no Are you going to no. change your beer because the mayor says? No, never. 
Never. Absolutely. Yeah, so just ignore him and keep drinking. That's what I say about a lot of things. Right. And, yeah. and let's just be real. Yeah. The people protesting probably aren't drinking beer anyways. I'm sure they're more wine ah. people or whatever. I'm actually, my new beer is going to be Sam Adams. I'm about to order me a keg when I get to the house. <laughs> so. so you mean you'll, you'll, get, you'll get like four glasses out of it? Because <laughs> I'm big. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, the, I hate boycotts, I hate, I hate, especially hate the one when they go, I used to be a fan until you said X, now I'm not. It's like it took one thing for somebody not to like you anymore. That happens to you a lot, I notice. It does. It probably has already happened during the show. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I used to be a fan. But I don't understand boycotts in general mm -hmm. because as someone who's a libertarian, Mm -hmm. and who doesn't have views that line up with either major party. Mm -hmm. If I only consumed things <laughs> that were created by people who agreed with me, yeah. I would die. You would. <laughs> I would. I would starve to death. I probably wouldn't be able to use soap in the shower. <laughs> and I like using soap in the shower, Greg. It's the best part. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it really is. <laughs> without... Without soap, you're just standing there getting wet for no reason. Yeah, that is true. But we don't do it. Conservatives don't boycott anything. No. Uh, it's, uh, you know, liberals get upset over, uh, all he did was say, was thank the president. Yeah, yeah. But we, I mean, I'm a conservative. I eat Ben and Jerry's, and it's called, like, commie crunch, and I yeah. eat it. Yes. <laughs> On that note, I think we've all made some very excellent points here.